Good morning, Tim. Just saw your message um, that you wanted to hear somebody's story. So this is my story. Um, I've been sober now. It will be coming on four years. My anniversary date is December 23rd coming up this year and it will be four years that I'm sober. And my rock bottom, I remember vividly, I was sitting over my toilet throwing up everything. It, I was a mess. There was puke in my hair, my walls, my everything around me and I just thought, oh my god, this sucks. I have to change this. Um, by that time, my addiction had me choose not so pleasant guys in my life. Um, the guy I was currently with, you know, addiction to both of us ran high and I lost my older daughter. I had lost my parents by that time. And I just remember that moment lying there thinking, oh my God, there has to be something better than this. I, I have to change. I can't, I can't go on. I had quit drinking before in when my older daughter was born, but I didn't work on my stuff. So my drinking creeped up little by little um, to the point that it got me four years ago that I was a mess. I had lost everything. I had lost a business that I was successful in. I had lost my house, my daughter, everything. And I knew I had to change. <laughs> Sorry. So fast forward <laughs> um, four years now. Oh my God, my life has completely changed. I am happy to say I have my daughter back in my life, which was huge. My daughter is now 22. We, she took me out for my birthday. We spent Mother's Days together. For the last year, our relationship has really, really, really increased. At the time I got sober, we didn't have one. Um, we never spoke. She wanted nothing to do with me. Rightly so, I'd kicked her out of my house at the age of 16 because I chose my addiction and this guy ahead of her. So now um, I have her in my life. I have my parents in in my life. Um, I'm running my own business. Now I'm coaching others through their addiction, through a lot of food things. And I'm successful doing my own business. I'm also a runner. <laughs> I'm so excited to, to say that. I've gone back into running. I'm training now for my first half marathon. Do I struggle? Oh yes. Yes, I think um, running and having my own business, my struggles come up daily. My ego comes in, you know, I'm putting shorts on to run. My ego goes, whoa girl, why are you wearing those shorts? You shouldn't be wearing those shorts. My ego challenges me and my business that nobody wants to listen to me, the old alcoholic. You know, who am I to tell people how to overcome their addictions? So yeah, I struggle with that. But what I lost before, what I didn't have, is what keeps me going. That I know so hard what that struggle is. And every negative comment that comes in, I deal with that at the time. I move ahead. But my life is so much better where it is now than where it was. Thank you for listening. Bye.